Castor oil has long been praised for its versatility, whether it's for nourishing skin, promoting hair growth, or relieving constipation. But while its benefits are undeniable, using castor oil the wrong way can cause more harm than good. If you think you know how to use this ancient remedy, think again. Today, we'll be diving into six crucial mistakes that people make when using castor oil. Mistakes that could lead to discomfort, irritation, or even severe health consequences. Stick around, because avoiding these missteps could save you from a lot of trouble. Mistake 1. Taking castor oil when you have diarrhea. Many people know castor oil as a natural laxative, often used to relieve constipation. But here's where things can take a dangerous turn. Consuming castor oil when you're already experiencing diarrhea is a recipe for disaster. Castor oil works by stimulating the intestines, which increases bowel movements. This is helpful if you're constipated, but if you already have diarrhea, taking castor oil will only make things worse. It accelerates the digestive process, leading to excessive fluid loss and dehydration, which can leave you feeling weak and dizzy. In severe cases, dehydration from excessive bowel movements can lead to electrolyte imbalances, causing muscle cramps, irregular heartbeats, and even fainting. So, if you're already dealing with loose stools, stay far away from castor oil until your digestive system is back to normal. Always listen to your body and, if in doubt, consult a healthcare professional before using any laxative, especially castor oil. Mistake 2. Using castor oil on sensitive skin with a history of allergic reactions. While castor oil is celebrated for its moisturizing and healing properties, it can cause serious problems if applied to sensitive skin, especially if you have a history of allergic reactions. For some, castor oil can trigger contact dermatitis, leading to redness, itching, swelling, and even blisters. The high concentration of ricinoleic acid, which gives castor oil its potent effects, can overwhelm sensitive skin, leading to more irritation than healing. If you have a history of skin allergies or eczema, it's essential to approach castor oil with caution. Instead of slathering it on large areas of your body, try a small patch test first. Apply a tiny amount to a less sensitive area, like your forearm, and wait 24 hours to see how your skin reacts. If there's any sign of irritation, wash the area immediately and avoid further use. Sensitive skin requires extra care, and castor oil's strong properties can sometimes do more harm than good. Always prioritize your skin's health and consult a dermatologist if needed. Mistake 3. Not considering the purity of castor oil. One of the biggest mistakes people make when buying castor oil is not paying attention to its purity. With so many options available on the market, it's easy to assume that all castor oils are the same, but that couldn't be further from the truth. Some products contain harmful additives, chemicals, or even preservatives that can significantly reduce the oil's effectiveness, or worse, cause irritation and damage to your skin or hair. Look for castor oil that is labeled as cold-pressed and organic. Cold-pressing preserves the oil's nutrients by avoiding heat during the extraction process, ensuring that you're getting the full benefits of the oil. Organic castor oil, on the other hand, guarantees that it hasn't been exposed to pesticides or harmful chemicals that could end up on your skin. Hexane-free castor oil is also essential, as hexane is a chemical solvent often used in oil extraction processes, which can leave harmful residues in the final product. By choosing pure, high-quality castor oil, you're not just protecting your skin, but also ensuring that you get the maximum benefits of this powerful natural remedy. Mistake 4. Not storing castor oil properly. Storing your castor oil improperly is another common mistake that can significantly affect its quality and shelf life. Castor oil, like many natural oils, is sensitive to light, heat, and air exposure. When exposed to these elements for too long, the oil can break down and lose its potency making it less effective when applied to your skin or hair. Worse yet, improper storage can cause the oil to go rancid, resulting in an unpleasant odor and potential skin irritation. The solution? Always store your castor oil in a cool, dark place. Keep it tightly sealed to minimize air exposure and avoid placing it near windows or heat sources. A cupboard or pantry is an ideal storage spot. If you want to go the extra mile, consider transferring your castor oil to a dark glass bottle, which can help protect it from light. Proper storage not only preserves the oil's integrity, but also ensures that you're using a product that's safe and effective for your beauty or wellness routine. Mistake 5. Using castor oil before 40 weeks of pregnancy. Castor oil has been historically used as a natural method to induce labor, but using it before 40 weeks of pregnancy is a dangerous mistake. While some women swear by it as a last-ditch effort to jumpstart labor, 
Castor oil's effects on the digestive system can also cause intense uterine contractions. If taken prematurely, it can lead to early labor, which increases the risk of complications for both mother and baby. Moreover, the side effects of castor oil, such as nausea, vomiting, and diarrhea, can cause significant discomfort during an already challenging time. It's essential to consult your doctor or midwife before using castor oil in the final stages of pregnancy. In most cases, healthcare providers will advise against using castor oil before the 40-week mark, as it can trigger labor when the baby isn't yet fully developed. Remember, it's always better to rely on medical guidance and safer methods to induce labor if needed. Your health and the well-being of your baby should always come first. Mistake 6. Direct Application of Castor Oil on Sensitive Skin One of the easiest mistakes to make when using castor oil is applying it directly to your skin without considering its strength. Castor oil is highly concentrated, and while it can work wonders for your skin, applying it directly, especially to sensitive areas, can lead to irritation, redness, or breakouts. This mistake is particularly common among people who rush to use castor oil without diluting it first or without thinking about their skin sensitivity. For the best results, always dilute castor oil with a carrier oil like coconut, almond, or olive oil before applying it to your skin. These oils help to buffer the intensity of castor oil, making it safer and more effective, especially for individuals with sensitive or acne-prone skin. Mix a few drops of castor oil with a teaspoon of carrier oil and perform a patch test before applying it to larger areas. This not only prevents potential irritation, but also ensures that your skin reaps the full benefits of castor oil's nourishing properties without the risks. By avoiding these six critical mistakes, you can harness the full power of castor oil while keeping your health and beauty routines safe and effective. From ensuring that you're using the right amount to knowing when to steer clear of castor oil altogether, taking these precautions can save you from a lot of unwanted side effects. If you found these tips helpful, be sure to share this video and subscribe for more in-depth insights into natural remedies and health tips. Stay safe and enjoy the many benefits castor oil has to offer.